avoiding my inner family, I feel like they're pissing off pizza, especially my family, because when it came time for me to choose a captain project, we got pizza. And my whole family was floating out ideas, and then my brother yelled out, what about pizza? <laughs> Here's my question. What is real New York pizza, and why is it so hard to duplicate in other places? Most people can agree New York pizza is best from the unduplicatable burnt brown side to the starchy and chewy cheese. Long story short, pizza is awesome. And I ask exactly my question. What is it about New York pizza that makes it so awesome? And why can't we find that awesome pizza in other places besides New York? Some studies show that one of the reasons New York pizza is so special is because the water is that the water they use for the dough. For instance, certain minerals in the New York water that when used to make dough are better tasting than the water from other places. I interviewed Adam Rowich, a pizza shop owner in Chicago. He believes that the water does matter does not matter in making pe good pizza. It just matters if you make the dough the right way. On the other hand, Anthony, another person I interviewed who owns a pizza shop in Brooklyn, thinks that the studies are right and that the water does matter. After a lot of research, I think that the water does matter. But before people even cared enough to do studies about pizza, it had to be invented first. So it all started with the Egyptians and the Roman death. Then the Greeks and the pita bread. Then the Italians, I mean to toppings, sauce, cheese, etc., or the raw dough, then cooking it. This was the first idea of pizza. Pizza was invented in Naples, Italy, June 11, 1889, when Neapolitan pizza maker Raphael Esposito created the pizza margarita, garnished with tomatoes, mozzarella, and basil to represent national colors on Italy, as shown on the national flag. When Italian immigrants came to America and settled in New York, along with the water, it made the perfect pizza environment. The first pizzeria opened in the United States was Lombardi's in Greenwich Village. When I went to Lombardi's, I got the opportunity to see the kitchen. The oven was made in 1905, originally made to bake bread. Today in the pizza world, there is more than just the original margarita pizza. There are so many more types including gluten-free, whole wheat, grandma, and grandpa pizza. Not just plain grandma and grandpa. <laughs> also, there are more toppings now than when pizza was originated. I did a poll on Facebook for the toppings around the world. The list is at my table. There are more than the, there are more amazing toppings than just the ones I just in New York. There are so many more different toppings around the world, and some might sound quite disgusting. The toppings aren't only the things that might differentiate the pizza. Pizza is different because of the water, like I said earlier, the dough, and the ovens. One difference between pizza is like is the water, like I said earlier. Another is the oven temperature and type. There's about three types of ovens: wood fire, coal, gas. These ovens can get to almost a thousand degrees Fahrenheit. One more difference is the way you make the dough. Every good pizza maker has their own recipe to make the dough. The average dough recipe contains flour, salt, yeast, and water. And throw in a pinch of sugar if you want it to taste extra good. This recipe is supposed to ferment for one to three days. One more thing is the technique, the way you do everything. In conclusion, you only make pizza special because of the water, the recipes, and most importantly, the history and heritage that lives in New York. And these are also the reasons why New York pizza basically can't be duplicated. Thank you.